the Wild West has returned. I must say, the faith that all of you have kept is admirable. Welcome back to Red Dead Online. All right, we're going to do some more posse missions. And I have... All right, I just got one thing to say. Wait a second. Ah, damn, I thought I got a... Thought I got a notification. Anyway, this update, it's it's no heist, but uh, it's uh, it's it's a much needed overhaul. It's pretty good. Anyway, uh, we're doing some posse missions. If you guys want to join up, be my guest. Anyway, uh, I have a plan to make some money, but I'm going to need some faithful cowboys. If we're going to do this thing right. Check it out. I got a cat cam. I don't know how long he's going to... Yeah. What the hell? God damn it, now I look... Look at that. My brand new Dutch outfit is all my... I don't know how long that my cat's going to... That's Eddie, by the way. In the cat cam over there. I don't know how long he's going to put up with my... With my Dutch yelling, but... Welcome back to Red Dead Online. They have just released an update that is going to allow us to make a shit ton of money. And as you can see, I I went for the outlaw pass, but now I'm all dirty. But I am wearing Dutch's duds. And look at this. This is pretty cool. Sadly, this outfit, it's just one it's one piece aside from the hat. So you can't uh you can't swap out anything like these gold rings that he has. These things are pretty cool. Come on. Ah, oh, damn it. I can't quite maneuver it. Let me try another gun. I don't think it's going to do what I want it to. No, damn it. Well, we're going to go do some missions, but first I want to show you guys the jewelry. Anyway, we are uh, playing with posse members. Like I said, this is the very patient baby punch. Uh, she's, uh, she's a saint. I've been moseying around town, getting some supplies, getting ready for this. But I'm going to send out some invites in a second. We're going to keep it to a smaller posse in the beginning of this stream because we're going to do the major uh, blood money missions. And those opportunities, I'm pretty sure, are locked to four-player posses. Maybe. Wait, what the? What the hell is he doing up there? Jesus, I leave town for three minutes and everything goes to hell. Yeah, that's Wild West cleanliness. Get your shitty boots off the meat counter. Worse than Peterson. My God. Anyway, check this out. This is the coolest thing, man. I wish that you could, uh, look at those rings. Oh, that is so Dutch. Gaudy as hell. Goodness gracious. He is a man of worldly tastes. That is for sure. You can't take the rings, though. You can't. You can't put the rings on anything else. You can't. Uh, you can't take his vest or his jacket or anything else. Unfortunately, it's all locked to the skin. But it is a nice skin. Look at that. Let me see if I can examine it real quick. Ah, oh, damn. Well, whatever. You guys get the picture. It's cool, though. It's a really cool skin. It's only 25 gold bars, and you make all those gold bars back through the quick draw pass. So it's a fair price. Arthur Morgan, on the other hand, is 52 gold bars, which is insane. Anyway, welcome Nova Bonk. Welcome Ethan. Welcome Alexander Vaught. Uh, man, that's an evil name ever since I watched The Boys. <laughs> I'm going to keep my eye on you, son. Welcome, have a taco. That would be an honor. Uh, DM it to me on Twitter if you do that. Oh, you know what? I should probably turn that cat cam off, shouldn't I? That's, uh, that's Eddie. He's my boy. He's my baby boy. I love him. He is a damn, damn good cowboy. Couldn't ask for a better partner in crime. All right. Let's, uh... Should we go back to Blackwater? Mm -mm -mm. Is that Sean over there? Yeah, it is. All right.
Blackwater. Why does everyone want to go back to Blackwater? Anyway, the Blood Money update has been met with a lot of, um... It, it's, uh, it's a decisive update. A lot of people don't... <laughs> a lot of people were disappointed by this update. Honestly, there was a lot riding on it. Rockstar advertised the hell out of this update. Why does everybody want to go back to Blackwater? <laughs> Where'd we stash that money anyway? All right, we're going to go uh, talk to Sean. But they basically replaced Stranger Missions with crimes and opportunities. And of course, let's not forget Capitale. Everything has to mention Capitale. Capitale of this, Capitale of that. Uh, you don't get ca much Capitale as rewards, by the way. You gotta look for them. In fact, we're gonna go after an opportunity in some of the bigger crimes, which will do a better job than I am of explaining the Blood Money update. Basically, they've replaced Stranger Missions, and they've made it so you can choose which ones you want to do instead of it being dealt out at random. You can now see if you want to do a stagecoach robbery or... A shakedown, you can rob houses, you can choose what you want to do, and they're not the exact same Stranger Missions as they were before. Additionally, they've added some new ones. You got bigger ones, you got smaller ones, and I think the payout's a little more fair, but I can't, I cannot speak on that subject with authority, because I am just coming back to Red Dead Online. It's been a while since I've played on the regular. Regardless, as somebody that wasn't really... As somebody that had tempered expectations, I'm actually kind of pleased with this update. There's not a whole lot of, like, stuff you can buy. They didn't add a lot of... St oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Who put a Halloween mask on the count? That is a gorgeous horse. I went for a bit of an outlaw look with my horse. He's a little mean. I like the braided look. Look at that. That is a mean horse. I love you, son. You're a good man. Horse, creature, whatever. I like you. You're a good, good, good... What? What in Sam hell is this? We have... You're a little sussy there, Arthur. I mean, du Dutch. <laughs> sussy baka. We have an imposter in our midst. And this time, the imposter is not red. It is black and white. You know, you're doing a better job with the gun belt than I am. And his guns are gold. They have a gold inlay. Now that is a fancy Dutch. Although I gotta say, you look more like the proprietor of the saloon from Deadwood than Dutch Vanderlyn. What, Ian McShane? Is that his name? Look like Ian McShane. Good luck. I maintain that Ian McShane is uh, the inspiration of, uh, you know, let me, let me turn off the cat cam. Ian McShane is uh, the inspiration of Dutch, at least partially. I don't know if you guys have ever seen the movie Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid, but if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's awesome. Really great film, and it definitely uh, is paid homage in the campaign of Red Dead Redemption 2. Regardless, let's see how many people we have in our posse right now, because I think we need four uh, total. All right, great. Great, we have three. Is there anyone around here that isn't a part of the posse yet? I'm going to send an invite. Uh, yeah. Who's this? <laughs> like, I want that imposter in our crew. Oh, what the hell? <sighs> oh, great. Great, he's in. Okay, now I'm going to lock the posse. I think it's already locked, though. Yeah, it's already invite only. I guess they're already a part of it. Damn. Well, I better be quick. That's more like it, son. I like how he kind of has the peaky blinders look. Some people are, oh my goodness, Arthur Morgan, you sack of beans. All right, whatever. Let's get started. Blood money missions. You can still do free roam missions if you want. 
But as you can see here, you've got uh, your choice of crimes. You can go for stagecoach robberies, house clearance, and then you have these bigger contracts, like uh, robbing the railroad company, which is, that one's pretty fun. I'm pretty sure these start over again once you finish them up. But uh, most of these, you're going to need to pay attention, especially the bigger ones, these here. Look everywhere. Look in chests, look in barrels, loot bodies. Capital is found, not given. Uh, they give you a little bit, but mostly got to find it. Anyway, here we go. This should be fun. This is an opportunity. And they charge capital for these, so this is gonna this is gonna be interesting. All right, let's go with uh. <laughs> In the true fashion of Dutch Vanderlyn, I'm going to make them do all the work. Okay. Hard. Good God. Here we go. Do I not enough? Do I not have enough capital? Do we have too many people? It's not letting me launch this. Uh, no, we got four total. That should be good. Let me try this again. Okay, here we go. What the hell? Why can't I? I don't have enough capital. How much capital do I have? Shit. I don't even have 15. Damn. All right. Well, uh, oh shit. It's up, it's up in the upper right hand corner. How much do I have? One. Are you kidding me? One out of 50. You can carry 50 maximum, I guess. Jesus. Well, we're starting small, I suppose. <laughs> okay. Uh, we failed this one last time around, but we're going to go uh, give it another shot. Railroad contract. Let's do this. Now, it ain't often I sit before you as excited as I am. Truthfully, I'm a little giddy, <laughs> and I'll tell you why. This Central Union fat cat bastard has dipped his balls in the cream for the last time. That's right. Word came down the line from Martelli himself. He wants this robber baron brought to him alive. Naturally, I gave him your word it was as good as done. That's the what. Now for the hell. There's a railroad bridge under construction down near McFarland's ranch. Find the foreman there. Pop his lad under the hammer until he tells you where his boss is holed up. <laughs> the rest I leave to your natural creativity. And if this bastard don't have a stack of capital in his top pocket, I'll kiss the next Englishman I see. All right. This should be fun. Um, I'm actually really enjoying the Blood Money update. I'm almost embarrassed to say that because everybody's just so up in arms about it. Uh, to be fair, a Redditor put this so succinctly. Dutch is Rockstar, and take two is Micah. Now, bearing that in mind, I kind of assumed what this update was going to be. I was shocked to see the amount of advertising they were doing for it. They I think they even called it a DLC a couple times. Which I guess it is technically downloadable content. <laughs> but people were expecting this was going to be a really big update like Grand Theft Auto's heists. It's not. It's, in my opinion, a much needed overhaul of the Stranger system. It was fun, but it was kind of redundant. It no longer is, but it's not what people wanted it to be either. Look at this! Arthur Morgan and Dutch Vanderlyn and Baby Punch and... <laughs> That scary son of a bitch, whoever he is. We ride again. Now listen up, all of you. We do not kill the train director. We live, we leave him living. Is that understood? Additionally, I need all of you to search every last nook and cranny on this train. Do not leave any stone unturned. We need that capital. All right, let's move out. Yeah, excuse me. My Dutch impression is a little uh, off today. I, d I did it for like two and a half hours yesterday straight. It got me good. Uh, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of innocent people. <laughs> the thing that gets me in uh, Red Dead Online is you're killing like 50 people at a time in these missions. <laughs> it's ridiculous. 
I mean, shit. You know that Marty Robbins song, Big Iron? And uh, Texas Red, how he killed 91 people? Yeah, I kill 91 people per mission. Texas Red, get on my level. Get off my horse, Arthur. You're like a son to me, but I have boundaries. Wait a second, did we kill the, the, the foreman here? Shit, I wasn't even paying attention. Damn it. All right, listen up. If any of you killed the foreman, I'm gonna be very upset. All right, we need to be very careful here. No mucking this up. If we do this right, if you stand by me, this could be our last mission. This is all we need for the money we require to go west. Do not kill the director. That is, that is imperative. All right, let's get out. I don't know how we messed this up last time. We had a big posse yesterday. We had like, uh, we had more people that could fit in a posse. So some people were just riding along. I don't know who killed uh, the director, but somebody killed the director. <laughs> Cost us to fail the mission, and uh, if you fail these um, these bigger missions, especially the multi-part missions, there's a cooldown of like 30 minutes before you can try it again. You can circumvent that to, uh, I think you just restart the game. You may not even need to restart, you just back out, come back into a new server, something like that. That should work. That's how some people are grinding out Capital. Capitale, my bad. Jumping on the horse like Spider-Man. <laughs> Alright. Listen up. None of you shoot the man. Take him in. What the hell? Where did I get this raccoon corpse? Is that for good luck or something? Man, there is something so cool about riding with a posse in this game. Ah, I don't know how many of you played the first Red Dead Redemption, but that online was a blast. It's been a long time since I've played it though, so I don't really remember that much of it. I just remember it was special. Look at him. Look at Arthur Morgan gunning after that train. Goddamn show off. Arthur! Slow down and leave some for the rest of us. Stop hot dogging it, boy! What is the new Capitale thingy? Ah, it's a way to... <laughs> Basically, it's tickets. You want to do certain missions, you need tickets for it. Shit! How do I jump on this thing? Come on! Come on! Get on the tr- Oh, shit. They got the director! Yes! Where is he? Wait, do we have the director? Oh, shit, he's in the back. All right, do not just focus on the director. Search the train. There's got to be Capitale on here somewhere. And we cannot miss it. That is the only reason we are here doing this. Get on it, people. The time does not make a difference. It doesn't make a lick of difference. Take as much time as you need. <laughs> what? <laughs> Some... Get back here. What the hell? What the hell was that? You ought, you ought to excuse me. Uh, Dutch, it, it takes a lot. I was screaming as Dutch yesterday. Look, I'm happy to do Dutch today, but don't expect me to be in my A game. Besides, I gotta keep this godforsaken animal alive that's on the back of my horse. Yeah, not on my A game today. Just like Arthur Morgan in the third act! <laughs> anyway, have some goddamn faith. Dutch will be back. If you stand by me, if you have faith in me, we will make it through this. All right, you know what? Godspeed, good speed, my bad. I think good speed actually surmises the real problem with this DLC. He says, uh, 
This new DLC is a serious waste. Seven months? Come on. Yeah, seven months. They've been working on this. For, actually, I think it's been longer. I think it's been almost a year they've been working on this Blood Money DLC. That's the real problem with this DLC. I like it. I wasn't expecting it to be like uh, Grand Theft Auto Online Heist. But for the amount of time that they took putting this thing out, it, it really should have been. See, the thing of it is, uh, <laughs> Red Dead Online, it doesn't get a lot of love. It's the red-headed stepchild, right? But the thing is, they took, I think, almost a year since the last major update. At least six months. Six to seven months. And they advertised the shit out of it, right? Blood money, you couldn't go anywhere. You couldn't go, you couldn't go on Twitter or Reddit without seeing something about blood money. And then it comes out, and it turns out it's, it's a quality of life overall. And there's not even that much you can spend your money on. People have been asking for, you know, customization and stuff you can get in single player that you can't get in multiplayer. And then they don't really give you all that much that you can spend money on. And uh, it's just a quality of life overall, which is a good update. This is a necessary update. But it's not. It's not enough. We expect some decency in this world. And they are not giving us the respect that we deserve. Not even close. I am trying to keep the faith, but it is hard. It is not easy, and they are not making it any easier. Here, maybe this will make it easier. There you go. This is a little cat cam. He is such a good boy. That is a good cat right there. His name's Eddie. He's a standard issue, but he's my standard issue. There are, there are many like him, but he is mine. And I love him dearly. He is like a son to me. He will not be the one to betray me in the end. He is not the type. He is a fluffy little little tiny baby boy. He is my little baby boy. My little yoga boy. boy. Oh my god. He's making me stupid. Alright, go away. Daddy is busy. Alright, man. Just look at this. Look how fucking cool this is. We just robbed a train. Sometimes you gotta take a step back. We just robbed a goddamn Leviticus Cornwall train. And we got the animal of the director. And we're taking him to church. Let God sort him out. God damn it, Arthur. Hey, we did we did that one pretty easily. There's a bit of a sweet spot for posses. The more men you have, the higher the fuckery meter goes. Which is fun, but when you got a crew like this, baby punch! She has faith. She is a real one. She is a very serious cowboy. She don't take shit. From nobody. She's like Miss Grimshaw and uh, uh, Hosea and Ar Arthur rolled into one. And then we got this guy. He's like Black Noir. <laughs> kind of dressed like Bill. Is that his horse? Very consistent. Yeah. And then, oh my God, he's even walking like Arthur. And then we have Arthur Morgan. It's good to see you, son. You know, good rotten son of a bitch! Damn it, I can't. Oh, ho, ho, ho. shit! I meant to punch you, Arthur, not your horse. Don't take it personal. Damn it, I can't punch him because he's in the posse. <laughs> Look, here's nothing personal, son. Your horse didn't deserve that. Flipping me off every chance he gets. Cocky. Bastard. All right, let's see where the closest blood money is. Why do you trust Micah? He is a good man. He is a good man. You're not seeing past the bluster, the heart underneath. Ah. <sighs> 
I'm replaying uh, Red Dead Redemption 2's campaign, and he's... <laughs> Dutch is stressing me out. It's so weird. The first time around, uh... I mean, I, I was, you know, it was tense. But this time, I, I'm just having such a hard time putting up with Dutch's bullshit, putting up with Micah's bullshit. Oh, man. Arthur Morgan. He's a real one. He's actually a fucking amazing character. He really is. In my opinion, he's like a perfect protagonist. His journal. Oh, man. There's such a... Oh. I'm actually really excited about a, a book uh, that my girlfriend's been pestering that I read. It's called Lonesome Dove. And once I finish my current book that I'm working through, I can't wait to go for it. I don't know if you guys have read it, but... Without having read it myself yet, I'm going to give a recommendation to it. It sounds incredible. It's set at the same time. I Maybe even the same year as Red Dead Redemption 2. It's kind of that romanticism of the, the West being tamed. You know, a sort of free quality of life being lost. To, civil, to civilization, to um, the, the loss of nature across America. The death of the West, if you will. Which is kind of what Red Dead 2 is about, but from the perspective of outlaws. Is that Arthur up there? God damn boy! He's fast. Yes, yes, the writing in this game is incredible. It is, it really is. It's not enough to say that it is. It really isn't, because you don't get it. Like, my girlfriend, uh, she started replaying, uh, she started playing for the first time Red Dead Redemption 2, like, a month ago. And she was, she was just gushing about it, like, this is so fucking good! And I was like, yeah, I know. She said, no, you don't know! You don't understand how good this game is! I was like, no, yeah, it's good, it's really good, it's, it's fucking fantastic, I know, I played it. But then I started replaying it, and I was like, yeah, no, it's really fucking good. <laughs> In my opinion, this game is an absolute masterpiece. I can understand why it's not for everybody. The setting is, you know, that's not for everybody. The gameplay is not for everybody. But nevertheless, everyone should be able to accept the fact that this is a masterpiece unilaterally. Oh, fuck, man. Hell of a game. All right. Well, we're going after another blood money mission, and I probably, I probably would have saved a hell of a lot of time if I just would have cut straight across, but... Like a good little boy, I follow the trail and son of a bitch! That was a two horse pile up! <laughs> Peaky blinders looking motherfucker. Yeah, that's right. You'd better use your own goddamn horse reviver, you horse's ass! Oh, my little raccoon buddy. I don't know who put this on my horse, but he's my good luck charm. I'm gonna get him back. Oh, he's still perfect, too. Well, that is good luck. Look at that. Everybody takes better care of my horse than I do. Thank you, baby punch. Don't tell anybody, but she's more of the leader of the gang than I am. Kobe! Kobe! No! I know everybody knows, pretty much, but still. No Red, Do no Red Dead 2 spoilers, everybody. None. I've actually been seeing a lot of people playing this game for the first time, and it's making me really happy. I mean, I'm sure they've already been spoiled. Everybody already knows. It's just for, uh, you know. It's just for respect. What the hell's going on up there? Who is that? Cutie forever. Cutie! Listen, we don't want any trouble. If you leave us alone, nothing will... Who the hell shot? Everyone, put your guns away. Cutie! I am calling for an armistice treaty. You don't shoot us, and we won't shoot you. That is the deal. You won't get a better one, son. I advise that you take it. Now then. You know what? Who's this? Cosmic Draw is not in here. I'm going to send him an invite. 
We're working to, uh, if you guys are just joining up, welcome. We're working to get some Capital. Once we get enough Capital, we're going to go after the big guns. We're going to go after the big mission. It's going to be a blast. The big mission, unfortunately, has a four-player requirement. You can't have over four players. But that's all right. We're going for the uh, second biggest contract. Let's see what this is. Oh, fuck. No, no! Damn it, it froze. I could tell it was coming on. It froze up for a second. Shit. <laughs> Damn it. I'm having some real problems with blood money. Only when I'm getting the contracts. Whenever I'm getting a blood money contract, there's a chance this happens. It's happened twice now. Once today and once yesterday. Ugh. You're, you're good, Kobe. You're good, Kobe. It's all right, boy. It's fine. Can't expect everybody to be unspoiled. Ugh. Tell you what, while we're getting back in, here is the cat cam. Bam. There you go. He's sleeping on his back right now. He's a good boy. I like to talk to him uh, like Arthur talks to his horse. You're all right, boy. He really is a good cat. Damn good cat. Oh, he's out of focus. Shit. I got you, boy. There we go. There he is. That's a good boy. You're all right, boy. What a beautiful... Handsome little boy he is. Who's my handsome little man? Who is my little dapper gentleman? My little civilized boy? You are. Molly will never understand what we have. What we share. It is special. You are special to me. Goodness gracious, I love him. Oh, God. All right. What a beautiful little field of cacti this is. <laughs> Wait, am I, am I taking tap? My controller is vibrating, but I think that's all that's happening. <laughs> God damn, I love this area. I always liked it. Even back in Red Dead 1. Okay, so we're back from the crash. <laughs> Let's see if our posse's still uh, together. Fetal alcohol syndrome, Dutch Vanderlyn. There he is. Got that bloat. <clears throat> I don't think I'm in the same server. No, I'm not. Well, here we go. I don't know who's online. I'm just, I'm just sending them out. All right. There we go. Nikki, did you see the Eddie cam? Oh, right, 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 right. Thank you, guys. I forgot. I'm appearing offline. Damn. All right, sweet. I really need to fill out these ability card slots. Chat room, for those of you that are experts, if you don't know, if you don't understand, do not answer. But... For those of you that are gunslingers out there, what's the best ability cards? What should I be going with? This is... Okay, I know I gush about this a lot, but seeing the, the people appear on the mini-map, like, ah, there's one! 
It, it almost feels like uh, like Pirates of the Caribbean, you know, when they're all coming out. They're all emerging. I just feel the power of this posse growing. Unlimited power. Yes. <laughs> God damn it. This is getting out of hand. Now there's three of us. I like even how the horses start when gunfire is erupting. That is fun. Three Arthurs and one. <laughs> three Arthurs. I mean, three Dutchies, one Arthur. How's that for cursed? <laughs> Look, we got an evil twin Dutch over there. You know, I'm surprised. This is the first time. I thought yesterday, the first day of the patch, I, we were going to see a ridiculous amount of Dutchies. <clears throat> this is the first time I'm seeing a bunch of Dutchers. I thought everyone would be playing as Dutch. White? What the hell does that mean? Shouldn't it be blue? Ah, uh, we're gonna get started in just a second, guys. Just a second. And if I kick you from the posse, it's just temporary. Don't worry about it. Alright, then. What about you, Mr. Blessing? Is he in? Oh my god, is that Bill? Kind of looks like it. Looks like a younger Bill. Where is Mr. Blessing? Oh, there he is. Can't invite him to the posse. Is he already, is he already in the posse? Just a second, guys. Oh, it's full. Well, listen. You are more than welcome to join us and follow us wherever we go. Like I'm gonna turn down free help. Yeah, that's real Dutch. Slave labor? Are you kidding? Dutch would be all over it. All right. Listen up. If you are with us, ride with me to Lake Don Julio. All right. We ride. Yeah. God damn, I love this game. This time around, we're gonna cut straight through and I hope to God we don't crash like last time. That's the only thing I've encountered of um, a glitchy nature in the update is the crashing when selecting blood money opportunities. So far, fingers crossed. Man, I lost that cool little raccoon. That's a shame. Can I even make it over there? <laughs> Let's see. Am I alone on actually liking Kyrian from the campaign? Who doesn't like him? He's all right. He's a fine boy. There's nothing wrong with him. I like him. I mean, okay, so... When I talk about Red Dead, just picture that I'm only... And I'm doing this out of respect for the game, okay? When I, whenever I talk about Red Dead, whenever I reference Red Dead, I'm usually very careful to only reference character traits, character qualities and such from Rhodes and before, all right? From Rhodes onwards, <clears throat> I'm usually not mentioning anything because I don't want to spoil a thing for this game. You understand? All right, James, please don't fuck me over like last time. Please don't crash. All right, what's this? Ooh, this should be good for us. All right, listen up, all of you yellow-bellied sons of bitches. We have a job. Jeb Phelps is his name. Listen, he has a lot of gold nuggets, capitale, and cash. So all of you are on cleanup duty. That means you search everything. You loot every body. You don't stop at nothing. I'm saying... Everything is searched. Now then, let's do this. Outlaws for life. Please tell me that we don't have too big a... Fuck yeah, here we go. Now, I ain't much for nostalgia. But here's a name that takes me right back. Jeb Phelps. <laughs> I arrested him not once, but three times. Slippery as an eel. Ran with a gang up in Van Horn. Stole Capitale, among other things. 
and how his gang have traded him in. I suggest you engineer yet another escape for old Jeb. In his gratitude, I'm sure he'll take you right to their stash. This is how you get Capitale, ladies and gentlemen. If you want Capitale, you have to search for it. Keep your eyes and ears open. They're not going to give it to you. You got to look with your eyes. Got to do everything around here. God damn. But really, you got to look around for this stuff. Chests, barrels, uh, bodies sometimes if they're important individuals. If they're just goons, they probably don't have anything, but you got to look for it. That's where the bulk of your capitale is coming from. People have been complaining they're not getting anything, but they're not looking anywhere. I do have a question for the chat, though, for those of you that are knowledgeable on the subject. Uh, look at this. Oh, man. This is a mean posse. This is what I like to see. Get all of your guns ready. We're going in hot. Woo! Now remember, there is no shooting Jed Phelps. Just the lock, please. There's nothing like commanding a posse in this game. Oh, good. Is that shit on his, on his tail? <laughs> hmm. That's pretty fucking cool. Take one of the dead bounty hunters to town and send his message to his former gang. All right, I need one of you to lasso one of these poor bounty hunting bastards and take him into town. We need a warning for the rest of his gang so they get the message. Hell, bring two of the poor bastards. Give them something to remember. I'm going to check this thing, make sure there's no Capitale on board. I don't think there is, no. No, there's not. Sometimes it's not going to be the first... Like, this is a multi-party mission, so... The Capitale may not be in the first part, or maybe in the second or the third part. What are you playing on? Black Squad, I'm playing on uh, PlayStation. I'm playing the campaign on PC. But I play online on PlayStation, so... I have the pleasure of enjoying this beautiful PlayStation 5 patch. For those of you that have an Xbox Series X, Series S, or PlayStation 5, uh, they just released a next-gen update. It's beautiful. Great textures. Better pop-in. 60 FPS. It's gorgeous. Ray tracing. I'm just fucking with you. This is Rockstar we're talking about. You don't get shit, and you'll be happy for it. <laughs> God damn it, Arthur. I said, don't shoot the town red. This is a good looking town. Every single town's gorgeous. You know, sometimes you just gotta appreciate the beauty of everything. Why is the vol- Yo, is the game volume a little too low for you guys? I'm gonna raise that slightly. There we go. There, let me know if that's good. Oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah, that was way too- There we go. Sorry about that. I didn't realize where that setting was. Jesus. Yeah, that's way, <laughs> way louder now. What the Oh, my God, the gang's here. Every mission, you are killing Herculean numbers of enemies. Don't shoot the horse, you savages. What the f what the fuck was that? See this one. Gotta be on your toes around this one. She is a pistol. Actually, she's a sawed-off shotgun that might explode on you. Like, it's filled with slugs that are too hot. Can't trust it. This guy, too? Can't trust him. He is a double crossing, no good bastard. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? He'll betray me in the end. He is the type. Yeah, let me know how that volume is. Should be good. 
You got a rosy future ahead, me and you, my friend. All right, I'm going to stop talking so much over everything that's happening. This is the first time I'm experiencing some of this stuff. Where's this safe house exactly? Ah, it's not too far, but let's see if he'll uh, come on horseback. Ah, shit. Was I taking too long for you, son? Rude. That is rude. We are cowboys, but we have hearts. We have feelings. Audio's perfect, thank you, Ken. Kinda sucks that there isn't cosplay on Red Dead 2 Online. Major sad. Well, man. Oh, crossplay. I thought you said. Okay, I was gonna say, I'm cosplaying as Dutch right now. You can cosplay as Arthur. There's cosplay. You're right, though. Crossplay is. God, dude, that's such a. Cross progression, crossplay. I tell you what, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's because of gold and microtransactions, because they figure. They release the PC version a year, year and a half later. There's gonna be people that are gonna restart and online, and they're gonna they're gonna do everything again, they're, and they're probably gonna want a level jump. And if they're gonna want a level jump, then they're probably gonna buy some gold or shark cards, what have you. All right, that was a good job. All of you did a fantastic job back there, but do not get sedentary don't get comfy we need more money a lot more money blackwater has set us back quite a bit so get ready we got another stage to this job another part of this contract and i need all of you on your a game shit i need all of you on your s game Yeah, that's right. We need more capital. What was that, son? Because all I heard was capitale. Because that is all my mind is thinking about. I don't have room for anything else. Search. All, I'm talking to all of you right now. Search your little hearts out for capitale. Is that understood? Oh, yeah. Chat room. I got a question for you guys. For any of you that know... Uh, is Capitale share? If you're in a posse, if you're doing a mission, one of these blood money missions, and let's say one of your guys opens up a chest full of Capitale, is that shared amongst all the posse members? Like, if there's one Capitale, do we all get one? Capitale? Am I saying Capitale too much? Because I'm not saying a quarter as much as Rockstar wrote in the script for every NPC in this update. Good God. They could really cut down on the Capitale references. It's not shared. All right, listen, I have a new plan. It turns out the leader of the posse, if he finds the Capitale, it's shared to all of you. Otherwise, it is not. So none of you take any Capitale. Tell me about it and I will take it for you. That is the price of being a part of this gang. <laughs> Poor bastards. <laughs> hey, I just hitched to that stump. How fucking cool is that? Man, I love the details of this game. And I love seeing all these horses. That is good shit. Look at this, we actually have a legitimate fucking gang here. Actually, that's not a bad idea, knockoff Dutch. I think I got a cigar on me myself. Let's see. You know, sometimes if you're playing as Dutch or Arthur, you gotta walk the walk and talk the talk. If that means I get lung cancer, that's a small price to pay. One more. Why the hell not? Hmm. Lung cancer. That's the good stuff. Hostess. Might be some capitale involved too. Turn off friendly new fire. Maybe wait. Some of your wait, 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 wait. Friendly fire on means that you can kill you can kill each other, right? Friendly fire off you can't. 
I thought it was already on. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna turn that off right now. Bastard. Baby Punch, you're a saint. Oh fuck. Privacy was open. <laughs> uh oh Jesus. Okay, there we go. Alright, back to business. Let's do this. How you getting on with Jeb Phelps? Kindred spirits? Ain't often you find one of those in this world. Better treat him right. For now. How about we offer him a gift? One of his old gang. Trust up and helpless as the day he's born. Then Jeb can have his way with him at his leisure. Find out where that old stash of theirs is. Feller up at Butcher Creek ought to fit that bill. Get his attention. And get him to Jeb in one piece or thereabouts. That was live footage right there. That kitty cat. He's a cutie. <clears throat> anyway, you're right. These are glorified stranger. <laughs> the thing is, we get what we get. At least for what this update is, it's good. It's necessary. It's, it's kind of like education. It's not, it's none too sexy, but it is necessary. Stranger missions needed to be overhauled. They were fun, sort of, but they weren't worth it. Now you can choose what stranger missions you want to do instead of it being random. Oh, goodness. I just want to say, it is a treat riding with all of you. James Goomster Baby Punch. Dan, uh, your name tag disappeared. <laughs> Give me a second. Cosmic Troll Howson. And Chef Boy RD, it is a pleasure. It is my pleasure. Thank you, all of you. Outlaws for life. Let's do this. Now remember, all capitale is mine. Thank you very much. How close are we? Ah, right up on it. I'm gonna show all of you how to get capitale. I'm gonna look for Capitale. It is up to the rest of you to protect my ass. Fight like hell. Man, I'm a mean bastard. I'm gonna try to steal all this Capitale for myself. Oh, fuck yeah. Do not set fire to the house yet. I'm gonna see if there's any Capitale around. Ah, this is how you're supposed to find it. You know what? There might be some on the roof. Is there? No. Damn it. All right, I'm thinking there's no Capitella here, but it's good to be thorough. Oh, moonshine still. This should go up easy. All right, man. I want you to light this thing up like it's the 4th of goddamn July. That'll do, son. That'll do. Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh, they're gonna be pissed. I just realized what we're doing. <laughs> yes, this is what I like to see. Arthur, no coffin on my new clothes. You got that? <laughs> oh yeah, real original. Here they come! There we go. Looks like I just killed Mr. Peterson. <laughs> it looked like Mr. Peterson. <laughs> A little skinny, bud. Same hat. By the way, speaking of hats, if you want to buy the Arthur skin or the Dutch skin, the clothes, I mean, only thing you can cust like swap out to other outfits are the hats. That's it. That's it. So keep that in mind. You can't take Dutch's gold rings and put them on someone else. By the way, if you guys have any idea on where to get Capitale in these locations, let me know. 
I should probably start checking around uh, some of these other houses. I figured it would probably be right on top of the yellow mission area, but maybe not. Maybe they're a little clever. Exactly, Haley. Exactly. You can set fire to buildings. It's very satisfying. This is the, the beauty of this game is how reactive the game world is. Do not kill the target. Lasso him and keep him alive. I wonder if I can rob him. Oh my God, Mr. Housem. I'm coming, son. Oh shit. What the fuck, poor bastard. Who's that, is that their boy? No, it's not the boy. Here comes the boy. Welcome. Dutch can't sing for shit. Did any of you find any Capitale? Remember the deal. You report any and all Capitale to me. Man, I didn't find shit. You, you, you can wear Duchess of Rings with other outfits? I didn't see that option and nobody... I didn't see anybody else seeing that either. That's fucking great if you can. Give me some more info on that, Mr. Jack. Oh yeah, yeah, the boys is very disturbing. Actually though, I mean it's over the top and it's gory, yes, but there's actually some disturbing stuff, like some body horror, for example. Permanent, uh, permanent disfigurements always gets me. It, I, it, sometimes it's kind of a cheap story maneuver, I guess, but whenever someone's life is changed permanently in an instant, that, uh, that unsettles me greatly. Don't think I don't see what you're doing, baby punch. Getting a free Uber. I see that. She's rich as hell. She's got all these cool horses. She's got a horse that looks just like the cow. And here she is, bumming rides. How about you put something in the camp donation box every once in a while? Would it kill you? Invincible's good. Thank you, Riley. Thank you. Uh, I'm guessing you're talking about one of the cars, right? Oh, no, no. Are you talking about Invincible, the show? I haven't seen that yet. I'm just level 35. I've played a decent amount, but almost all of my playing has been uh, screwing, screwing around. Let's see what level we are in the Quick Draw Club. This uh, is what replaced the bounty pass or whatever. It's it's a it's a battle pass is what it is, but they're faster than they used to be. So instead of one every couple months, they basically do one each month. They're about a month long. It's quicker to uh, complete them, and what the hell are you whistling about? Oh, change the outfit. Cool. Looks nice. What the hell are you whistling about, son? Driving me out of my goddamn mind. Jesus Christ, I'm gonna go insane. Stop it. You're driving me nuts. I gotta get out of here. Oh my god. What the fuck? You're cruel bastards, every last one of you. God damn it, we're back at Blackwater. Why are we always going back to Blackwater? Oh no, that's Van Horn Trading Post. What the hell is wrong with me? We're not even close to Blackwater. Alright, uh, let's see. Where should we go here? We're doing some blood money stuff right now. What the f- What is it? They're whistling at me. Why are they whistling at me? Oh my god, guys! I feel like they're trying to tell me something important, but I don't know what. I don't understand you. Speak English. I don't speak whistle. Oh my, I'm, you know, I'm getting the hell out of here. That's it. That is it. I hope you're happy with yourselves. I feel like we should probably go to St. Denis. 
Yeah, what the hell? Let's go to Saint Denis. It's not that far. Or is it? Actually, it's plenty far. Let's go to the fast travel post. Be sure to check your benefits. Rockstar, I like yesterday or today, sent me like 50 bucks. I'm using it for fast travel. I'm treating it as uh, as my little coin purse for fast travel funds. Whenever Rockstar sends me free money, I make a mental note of it and I just allocate like, all right, I got $43 left for fast traveling because <laughs> they bleed you dry. That's why Rockstar's Dutch and Take-Two is my good. My, take Two's a bad influence. But Rockstar is Dutch. I'd buy that for a dollar. Hey, check it out, Cat Cam. With the power of this brand new technology, you too can witness a cat in real time sleeping his little what life away. You get what I'm what I'm referencing here? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Wait, 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 there it goes, there it goes. Yes! Beautiful. I was at a, when I was a kid, I was at a auto shop waiting for my uh, mom's car to be finished, worked on, and then uh, I was just sitting, killing time, and they had this DVD screensaver. And I was bouncing around, the classic one. And it ne I was sitting there for like an hour, and I would keep looking at it. Never hit the corner. Not once. Terribly frustrating. Surprised I never had a, had a therapist growing up. <laughs> what? Son, have you lost your head? Good Speed says, we need a game changer update, like sandstorms in New Austin, or tornadoes in the Heartland, or snow blizzards in, in the Grizzlies. That would be a game changer for real. Yeah. Yeah, Rockstar is going to add a Geostorm update for free. Especially because it's something they couldn't monetize. Or they're going to sell, like, a, 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 a stagecoach made out of steel to protect you from the tornado. Only purchasable with gold. Maybe then. Other than that, I don't see it. I don't see it happening. Yeah, if you're lucky, if you're right. Opportunity. Might even uh, have involved. We haven't done this one. I wonder why these aren't available. Come back to me on that one. All right, uh, I'm thinking railroad contracts probably going to be our best bet. So, let's go for... How much Capitale do I have? Oh, I still have one. This is ridiculous. It is a bitch to get Capitale. All right. So, I hear you're looking for Capitale. You best be ready to make some real enemies. Railroads, my friend. Folks running them make me seem like a regular philanthropist. <laughs> and they got old Uncle Sam in they back pocket. Seems there's bad blood between the Central Union Railroad and your friend, Martelli. They're laying track down in New Austin. You go get your hands on their supplies. Coming in tonight, you'll get more than fair price. And I wager you'll find some Capitale down there, too. Do birds with one bullet. Man, these loading screens are long. Mr. Morgan. We're running low on loading screen. 
That doesn't make sense. We're running low on lack of loading screens. <laughs> Mr. Morgan, bring in a PS5 patch when you find the time. Appreciate it, Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, we're running low on frames. We're only getting 30 FPS. The people are starving. God damn, this game looks good. Look at this. Have you seen a more handsome po No! Sir, you do not ride in front of the- Oh, ma'am. Sorry. Ignore me. You're good. The rest of you stay back. No, not you! See, that's, uh, there's a moment in the store- Oh, fu Oh, fuck! You see what happens when you usurp the boss. Chaos! Horror! The horror. Oh god, the horror. Anyway, uh, there's a point in the story where Dutch tells someone to get up off a chair, because he's gonna take the chair, he's gonna sit in it. And my girlfriend was, she came, and she, when she went to that part of the story, she was like, what a fucking dick this guy is. And I was, I said, you know, normally I would agree with you, but not here. Because if you're Roman, and think about this, alright, actually consider it. If you're Roman with a band of outlaws, you have to have some sort- No one search anything! You listen to me, you thieves! Do not! Cosmic Draw, you get away from that. All of you, get back! Don't you put that wolf on that fuck, you sack of shit! I got my eye on you, goom. All right. Let's see if we can find some Capitale. Uh, that's a clue, but, you know, I'm, I'm gonna... Search everything, just in case. There's something back here. Ah, look at this. See, this is the type of stuff you need to be looking out for if you want to make the big bucks. Capitale, there we go. We just got one. Some of these have three Capitale in them. What the hell are you... You mount... <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's getting old dirty. Never mind. Ignore me. I'm not saying anything bad. Certainly not talking about mounting a dead wolf corpse. That's burned to shit. I don't see if I don't see if there's anything else. That's empty. Nothing on that card I can take. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything here. Well, one capitale, huh? God, that's so, that's so Rockstar. They're so stingy. But it just goes to show you really have to look for everything. There's a lockbox behind a fallen tree by the tent. Ah, really? Well, there's a fallen tree near a tent right here. Let's see in a lockbox. Nevertheless, I appreciate the tip. Nope, no Capitale. Oh, would Eagle Eye show me Capitale box? I thought, you know what? I rarely use Eagle Eye in the story. So we already searched that one, by the way. I rarely use Eagle Eye in the story because it feels like cheating. Yeah, I think we cleared it out. Well, at least you guys know to check that box from now on. Yeah, you have to find it. Uh, they don't really... They don't really give you Capitale as a reward. Unfortunately. You gotta look. Tommy, you there? All right, all of you open fire, but do not take any Capitale, and that is an order. Oh, 
Oh, that's one of ours. My bad. He's <laughs> about to blow his goddamn head off. Yeah, the whole time we were playing yesterday, I was wasting so much time, so much capitality. I should have been searching everything. But I wasn't. To be fair, you're, you're not going to get a lot, no matter what. You may get, I think the high end for a, for one mission is like three. Capitale. Which is not good. That is bad. Oh shit, I'm not even on my horse. Sorry, baby punch. You know, your ponytail is the same as my horse's... <laughs> my horse's braided tail. <laughs> <laughs> same, same color. I think they may have even reused that asset. I think the, the the woman's ponytail, they reused it for the horse or the other way around. I'm not sure. I mean, it looks good either way. I'm just saying. It's just an observation. God damn, that's a nice horse. Looks like a cow. What the hell you got there, son? Jesus Christ, it's covered in mud. Who the hell's gonna buy that? Oh, shit. Good God. Please, would someone refrain from killing the horses? Son of a bitch! You cost me money! You know, I think that's why they have roads. So you know, T-bone a tree! Idiot. Now I'm just sad. This is a 30 minute, co at least we're right next to Joe. This is a 30 minute cool down for this shit. I better still have that Capitale. Hey, Dutch, is it true that you raised the cow when it was just a fowl? Yes, I hand fed it. In fact, I was raised by horses myself. I guess that's why I'm a horse's ass. <laughs> Explosions. Classic. Okay. Uh, I think this might be a decent Capitale mission. But we haven't done the Blue Water contract yet, so let's do it. Working for this man will be the end of you. You listen to old Joe. His type means the end of you. Back up. I was going to do this job myself, but I won't set foot in Blue Water Marsh. Things live there as should have died. Died there as should have lived. Whispering. Watching. Well, I bet you ain't afraid, because you're a fool. There's a man. Blue Water John. Used to run with a gang till the marsh got in his soul. Well, his old gang owes a debt to the Italian. Stole some of his precious Capitale, too. They gone to ground. Start with John. Get to them. Hope you're feeling brave. Never heard the... <laughs> term Capitale before? You mustn't have played this update. The amount of times I've heard it. If it was a drinking game, I would have, uh... I would have died unless I had Johnny Depp's liver. <laughs> yes! You get it. Even bad men love their mamas. Anybody who gets where that, where that uh, reference is from, friend for life. One of the best westerns. It's recent, but it's damn 
It's a fine film. It's all right, boy. It's not bad. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Don't rough him up too much. Don't touch the man's guitar. Come on. We are gentlemen, after all. It'd be cool if there's like a note we we could read that would tell us to go to Pleasant's settlement. Maybe this is the first time you do it. If you're repeating, if you're grinding out for Capitale, you know, you don't want to go through that every time, but give us a little romance. Give us a little chase. You know, a little something. I think little things like that, a little bit of set dressing now and then. Doesn't have to happen every time. I know it'd get old, but I think that'd go a decent way to giving people what they want out of this. I mean, what they really want is a complex, multi-part mission of our robbing a bank or a train. Kind of like what you did in Valentine in the single player in multiplayer. Or like the GTA Online heist. That's definitely what people really want. Or maybe being able to buy a homestead and purchase some cattle. I guess that would be a little like the Moonshiner uh, career, but still. It'd be nice. Something, Rockstar. Nevertheless, I do like this update. The, the thing is, I, I, I like this update, but I don't deny that we <laughs> needed more than this update after seven months. Now listen up. The same rules stand. Dutch searches for Capitale. The rest of you protect him. Me, whatever. All right, let's find some Capitale. Cash bag isn't what we're after. That's worthless. The Capitale, on the other hand, that could be worth something. I don't think there's going to be any nightstands, but what the hell, let's take a look anyway. Strangers are usually not going to have uh, Capitale on them unless they're <laughs> something higher than a goon. But these guys are, they're rankless practically. I don't think they're going to have anything. It's crazy how people, I don't deny, I don't deny NS, but it's crazy how people are nostalgic for 2015 already. Back when Star Wars was king. I mean, people complaining about the Mary Sue stuff. I didn't buy into the Mary Sue stuff at the time. And I still think that they could have done that right. Force Awakens... You know, they could have, uh, they could have made a good trilogy from that. They didn't have a plan in the first place, though. I don't think we're gonna find any Capitale. Oh, you know what? I should start using Eagle Eye. Not a fan of Eagle Eye. It's like detective mode from, uh, uh, Batman Arkham Asylum. It's a cheat. It's a no good cheat. But damn it, I need that Capitale. Hey! Any of you guys find any Capitale? I don't think there's any. I'm pretty sure that it's not randomized either, so... It's not like, uh... 
first time around, you know, Capitale wasn't here, but next, you know, the, the second time, there was a lockbox behind the shed. No, I'm pretty sure it's predetermined. Yeah, maybe in the next area. The thing is, you shouldn't have to grind a mission 15 times to do another mission. Every time you want to do that other mission. That's a lot. Game volume is very low compared to my voice. Really? That's really low? Let me know, guys. I'm watching the chat. We're cutting across the bayou. Watch out for alligators. The good, the bad, and the ugly is fantastic, but personally, I've got a soft spot for a few dollars more. The Dollar Trilogy is excellent, no matter which way you cut it. They're all fantastic films. The good, the bad, and the ugly. You know what? It's hard to say, because for a few dollars more has such an excellent soundtrack. So does the Ecstasy of Gold, uh, the trio. Oh, man, the trio. What a piece of music that is. Doing that cool, badass, slow walk. I trust you have no trouble. All right, so that is low. Okay. I'll raise it up then. It looks like the audio is coming close to matching during gunfire. Let me try it again. How's that? Is that better? We're simple people. We hear a whistle, we return. Oh, shit, that's a cool detail. Look at that, it's a... Uh, grain mill? I don't remember what they call it. They hook a horse up to it and they go in circles and it grinds grain into flour. It's cool. Flour mill, maybe. Such a nice detail. Damn, I love this game. Do any of you have 15 Capitale? Anyone? <laughs> How much Capitale do you have? Not looking to steal or nothing, I'm just curious. Oh, that's right. Thank you, son. I forgot about that. All right, let's go see how much Capitale is to purchase. Rockstar, clever, very crafty they are. All right, I'm pretty sure I remember where the fence is, but just for efficiency's sake. Yeah, right past the, okay. Look, it's been a while since I played on the regular. That's just pinstripe pants. Man. Look, I know it's played out, but damn, it is cool dressing up as Dutch. Have forgive me, I'm a little busy. I have to leave for strawberry very soon. Man, this market's awesome. Alright, let's see how much this is gonna hurt.
Alexandra managed to find the session. Damn. That <laughs> must have taken a lot of uh, a lot of random server joining. I'm impressed. I wonder if that hired gun kid's worth it. Alright. Uh oh. Capitale. Oh, you buy it for gold. Okay. Well, okay. Prices, you know. Okay, this is a little I want to say this is a little dirty of Rockstar. So they purposefully make Capitale a major grind. And they barely, you don't, even, you don't even get it as a reward half the time. You have to find Capitale. You gotta find it. Which means you're much less likely to procure large amounts in a short period of time. Or a long period of time. So instead, you can't buy it with dollars. You have to buy it with gold. Unbelievable. How much? Uh, let's see. Three for ten. All right. I'll bite. God oh, damn it, Rockstar. Enjoy it. You slimy bastards. All right, let's go do a big one. And if you want to do it at a higher difficulty, it costs more Capitale. Something so badass about everybody waiting outside while I was making the purchase. All right, listen, Major Pork Chop. Welcome, friend. Listen up. We have enough Capitale for this job. I need all of you to fall in line. Join me up at Joe. Welcome, sons. Let's do this. I've been looking forward to seeing what this is actually. Oh, shit. I heard Dutch kill the girl in Blackwater. All right. I've been looking forward to this. I have no idea if this is, uh,. If this is gonna be elaborate or not, but this is the Capitale mission. This is the big boy. We're gonna do it at normal difficulty until uh until I understand. That almost looks like a like if Dutch was a woman, he might dress like that. Very gaudy, but stylish, nevertheless. Martelli says I'm only to hand it over once you have enough Capitale. Aqua Dragon, my son, I apologize, but we can't have too much talking or it's going to come back as noise over the microphone. None of your concern. Let us handle it. You want that oh, that's right. We're going for Anthony, not Joe. Seems every other crook and cutthroat I meet these days is working for Martelli. Where it is, Senior Martelli has a mm, new That's right. We need a smaller posse for this. <laughs> All right, listen, we need a smaller posse for this mission. I apologize, but it's going to be random. I'm going to kick the last four people in the posse. Because we have to have a smaller group. Bear with me. All right, last three, it turns out. My sons, I am sorry, but we will have more. And we will make more money. On with we will Find return. Him. We don't leave people behind except for Daisy. Davy, shit. And Jenny. About oh, poor days. Jenny. Hell, I got some myself. <laughs> All right, here we go. 15 <laughs> Capitale. This better be worth it. Actually, we may as well go for 20. Let's do it. So close to 25. Damn. Well, looks like Martelli will have his monopoly back under control in no time. Thanks to you. He sent you this. Hope it was worth it. Now listen up, this is gonna be on hard. I spent six gold lining rock stars pockets for this 
I need all of you to be on your top game. I need Apex Outlaws. No substitutes. If anyone has to be kept alive, no accidental killings. Zero tolerance. That being said, you are a fine group, the best of the best. That is why you are accompanying me on this. I expect nothing less. <laughs> These missions are crap Italian. Very good. That's very, that's <laughs> very good. You recall we spoke of him? The man who has so foolishly been trying to make his reputation at the expense of my employer. He wishes to put himself and his beloved Lemoyne in the headlines of next year's Centennial State Fair in Sacramento. And he has devised quite the centerpiece. Three of the world's most famous jewels brought together for a single exhibit. Except, we will ensure they never meet. One by one, as they are taken west, you will find them, you will procure them, and if you value my friendship as highly as you should, you will bring them to me. Today's prize, the Covington Emerald. It was found some years ago on the island of Guam and procured by Mr. Luther Covington, the steel magnet. Like all your philanthropists, Mr. Covington is hungry for publicity. So he was only too happy to offer his prized jewel to the state's fair. It is traveling west by train under the protection of the San Denis Police Department. You should expect the area to be under very careful guard. Though I recommend you speak to the station clerk. He is a man who is keen to help our organization. Now, none of you worry about the station clerk. I will take care of him. We're playing this rough. It's gonna be hard. As hard as Dutch Vanderlyn's apt. So, I need all of you on backup, including you, Arthur. No hot dog in. Am I understood? Put your guns away. Wait until I give word. Stand back and stand by. I'm gonna go deal with Saint Denis Station. We will get. This emerald, this is the job that we need to go west. Damn with what Hosea says. We need money. I gotta say, that cinematic was kind of slick. That was nice. That was tight. The Saint Denis police, they looked so cool. Man, I, w I wish I was playing this on PC. We're playing on PlayStation 5, but there is no PlayStation 5 patch, sadly. Whoa. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that shit, that shit is not gonna fly. No running in with horses. Listen to what the man says. I need all of you on your best behavior. No Blackwater shit. No Blackwater in here. Man, stealth makes me so goddamn nervous in this game. Who the hell is that? Shit, this is pretty fucking cool. So, Capitale is rarely given as a reward in this update. Instead, you have to find it. You gotta search for it. And I'm wondering if there's Capitale around here. That is a nice hat, baby punch. Woo! Shit. Train's gonna get out of here. All right, listen. Carefully, we need to get away on that train. Carefully! If they spot us, we are screwed up shit creek without a paddle. Spread out and find a way in. Anything in here? Capitale? 
Empty. Shit. Alright. Interesting. We only have one life for this. I'm not seeing any clues, and I'm not seeing any Capitale either. Oh, shit. What the hell? Fuck! Screw it! Get on the train, boys! Now! Move! All of you! Shit! This is not good. I heard Dutch shot a girl in Blackwater. That's the last thing we want to hear here. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, thank fuck. Thank fuck. Let's retry the checkpoint. Shit. That did not go well. All right, that was a mess. Absolute mess! My poor cat. Here's my cat cam. He's, he's sleeping right behind me. I'm yelling, I'm screaming. Look at that. You, you can see him breathing. See that? <laughs> you can see him breathing. Well, I hope so. It'd be kind of creepy if I just had a dead kitty. Oh, I can't even say it. I love him too much. He's a good boy. He's all right. Fix your levels, boy. I'm gonna do my best. All right, any of you guys have any ideas on how we do this right? Anyone, everyone put your guns away. We're going in quiet, just like last time. Be sneaky. I hate being sneaky in Red Dead. The stealth is... It's very touchy. It's very sensitive. I don't have a lot of practice with stealth in Red Dead. God damn it, I'm an outlaw. I'm not a Sam Fisher. Jump on the crates and go into the roof. Go on quick and fast. Best way is not to die. <laughs> Thanks, fellas. I appreciate the assistance. And what do we do with the boats? Alright, someone in the chat said that there's fireworks we can set off as a distraction. That sounds good. Alright, spread out and look for fireworks. We need to launch those as a distraction, but do not get spotted. Don't get too close. To any police. Seduce the guards. <laughs> I do have sexy abs, but I don't think that is appropriate at this time. Station clerk. Station clerk. All right. Okay. Okay. Easy, boy. All right, let's talk to that station clerk, I guess. <laughs> no way we can just buy a ticket out of the train. Hey there, how you doing today? I might got something of interest to you. Wait, that's a post office worker. This note's got some details on extra goods the lawman's keeping under wraps. Don't know what, but sure it'd be worth nabbing. You can keep it all, too. Some kind of bonus, I expect. Going for a score to grab all the fixes, right? More in the pocket. Never hurt nobody. Shit, what do I do with that list? Damn, 
the train's about to depart. I gotta be quick. Real quick. Fuck. Detonated on the mini-map? Oh, yeah. Here I see boxes and fuck! Get on the train! Go! And do not die! Shit! Shit! Oh, hell yes! Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! We're getting them, boys! Oh, fuck! Horse shit! No! Good lord. Good god. Stop the train! Shit. Oh, beautiful day! Everyone, search the train! Fuck. Shit. Horse shit! I can't get on that train if I'm behind it. I gotta wait until the bridge. This is just like a mission going south in the single player. This is not well. This is bad. Come on. Yes. 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 Shit. All right, do not loot the chest until I get there. Stand down. Protect me! You know, I bet there's a lot of Capitale on this train. All right, where's this god? There she is. Let's see what we have, boys. Good shit. All right, well done. We have the jewel pouch. Look around for any Capitale we may have missed. I'm sure there's extra Capitale in this train. Take the potent health cure. God damn. Yeah, there's a chest up ahead. I bet it has Capitale inside. Wait, where the hell is that chest? Oh, is that where we're taking the jewel? There's a, yeah, I, maybe. No, that's just a chest along the way. Great. Shit. I wonder if we could have done this stealthily. Wait, it's not making a stop? Shit. All right, I'm going for a huge risk. This is not going to be easy, but I need you to watch my back. I'm going in for the extras. I'm sorry, is this Dutch Vanderland or a stormtrooper? Fuck! Woo! Where's this chest? Fuck. I don't see no goddamn chest! Where is my backup? Get over here! Where the fuck is this thing on the roof? Oh shit, I see. Thank God! What is it, what is it? Are you kidding me? 
It's fucking empty. It's empty. There's nothing in there. It's useless. All that work for nothing. Fuck, we're out of team lives. Hop on. Let's roll. All right, it's pretty fucking cool watching Dutch ride like hell, hatless, with a with a rifle. That looks awesome. I am loving this. Molly, eat your heart out. <laughs> I've never heard that. Someone just said that they heard someone in Saint Denis say, uh, nothing wrong with having a little fun with his sheep. Yeah, okay, buddy. <laughs> you sussy baka. God damn, where the hell is this drop off point? We're doing this on hard difficulty, so I'm expecting this is going to be a good reward. Where are these other chests? All the way back in Saint Denis. Oh, hold it. Hold on. Sorry about that. I thought someone knocked. Thank God nothing happened. <laughs> Well, aside from that, thank God nothing happened. Watch where you're driving. Jesus Christ, I'm dealing with amateurs here. Man, my Dutch voice is slipping. Look, it's not an easy voice to keep up for extended periods of time. Actually, I uh, did the Dutch voice for two hours straight with uh, Sounds Like Pizza, and he did the Arthur voice for two hours straight, so we did like a two-hour stream. I did it completely in character. He broke once or twice. First you crack, then you break. First you crack, then you chuckle. Yeah, this cost nine gold bars. Yeah. It was not cheap. Actually, wait, wait, I think it was six. Yeah, no, 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 yeah, yeah, it was nine, because we went for the 25, not the 20. Wait, are we on very hard? <laughs> Shit, I don't even remember. You have the emerald. Incredible. The look on... Pleasure doing business with you. Man, I was hoping for some sort of a badass, uh, ending cinematic or something. But still, that was pretty cool. It would be even cooler if we had, uh, I don't know if it's a, if that's a chance, if we just missed it, but if lawmen were pursuing us, that'd be pretty sweet. Because that was a long distance from Rogues to the drop-off point, so if we could have had a chase. Firing our guns. Wild cowboy action. That would have been nice. Oh my god! God damn it! Fuck! I I fucking I lined Rockstar's pockets with my change. And I this is the thanks I get. Oh my god. Did all of you did all of you in the posse blue screen with me? Stand by me stay with me we have been through worse we will get through this and by the way for those of you in the chat it is time you carry your weight leave a like subscribe put some meat on mr pearson's wagon something Fuck. Okay, so 
Chef Boy RD, who was a part of our posse, who was playing with us. He got $158. $158? Did you get anything else or was that it? Because that seems like a ripoff. Six gold bars for that? Jesus. <laughs> hey, guys. Great news with the latest Red Dead update. You can trade gold bars for Red Dead Online bucks. Six gold bars for 158 uh, you only get like $200, or I guess 158 to 200 and point thirty six gold. Jesus Christ. And yeah, 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 right, you're right, I got, I, I did pay like 9 gold bars, because we did the, you can pay 15, um, uh, Capitale, or 20 Capitale, or 25, and I think we paid 25. And 25, no, we didn't, because we only had 24 Capitale, that's right, but I'm pretty sure it's three gold bars for 10 Capitale, so I paid six gold bars, and we did the 20 Capitale, so I should have four Capitale left. <laughs> Nevertheless... Zaku just got $189 on a Ruthless and .36 gold. Wow. Dutch Vanderlyn, Rockstar. Take two, Micah. Good lord, legends are true. Son of a bitch. I'm, you know, I'm actually a little disappointed. That's That kind of seemed like a scam. You got 50 Capitale in an hour? Please, El Blasto, share us your wisdom. I would be most appreciative. What do you do, son? How do you do it? <laughs> You're right, spending gold's not the way. You can grind it out, but we weren't finding... We were Apparently, the train mission's a good way to get Capitale. But, we may not have been searching in the right places. We searched, and we weren't able to find any Capitale. I gotta say, that Arthur skin is nice. And that's a pretty good Arthur. See? Arthur has a beard. Dutch does not. So, my Dutch kind of looks... He looks better, I swear to God. They updated the Red Dead Online player models, but... He's got a little alcohol bloat. But I like it. He doesn't look pretty. You know, he's, his face is ruddy. It's got some pock marks, rosacea, burst capillaries, etc. It's good. It's real. Ladies, you may not like it, but this is what a real man. Capitale is a money thing. It is for us capitalists. It is from the country of capitalism. Who the hell's shooting at us? Who dares? <laughs> Ten points for that flip. <laughs> that was good shit. You see that? Do the train mission. Third one. You have to loot the man you're supposed to capture. Oh, you know what? Thank you, Blasto. I think I remember reading something about that on Reddit. So, train mission, third part. Loot the man you're supposed to capture, kill him, fail the mission, and reset the timer by hitting crimes in the menu. Let's give it a shot. Let's let's go let's go try it. See? Baby punch, look, look at your braids, and then look at the horse's braids. Tell me! That Rockstar, tell me that Rockstar didn't just reuse the horse's braids for the girls, so then the, you know, the, maybe it's the other way around, but it's something. I'm gonna crack the case. Your horse is trying to kill me. Do you have a Discord? Yes, I do. I don't remember what it is. I need to, I need to start using Discord more. I got a Twitter. Tell you what. I'm gonna add my Discord into Nightbot. That'll be better. Should have done that from the start. What's up, Slava? What's up, Oscar? Welcome. And welcome, Marissa. 
You know what? Let me just pull up on my phone. My Discord is... Uh... Don't text and drive. Don't text and ride. Um, there we go. It is, uh... God damn it. How do I look... How do I look it up? I am completely <laughs> ignorant when it comes to, uh, Discord. Where the hell is, uh... Ah, oh, shit. You need an invite link. All right. Tell you what, I'll, I'll do it during the cutscene. Let's go to Joe. Looks like Dutch's sister. Look at that. Mean. She inherited the brains and the brawn. All right, can you select, uh... Hmm, okay. I was hoping you could select a specific part, but it looks like you Working cannot. this man will be the end of you. You listen to old Joe. His type means the end of you. Railroads. I don't use them. Don't trust them. You know who makes the railroad? Parasites. They act like they're our saviors, but they're no better than me. They're worse. I'll prove it to you. There's a new track getting laid northeast to here. Go and steal their supplies. See how quickly the rabid dog bears its teeth. And they got some of your capitale, too. Up to their neck in it. What further proof do you need that they're filth? Go. These loading screens are ridiculous. <sighs> Rockstar's got a good engine, though. I'll give him that. Cat Cam is back. Look at him. Look at him. My little man. He's got little paws, little feet, laying on his little chest. Goodness. He looks like a bowling pin fell over. I, listen, I'm playing, uh, if I could transfer my progress from PS4 to PC, I, I would be playing on PC. PC just got, here's the thing about Red Dead. All right. I fucking love this. I love riding with a posse. So, since our game crashed and we're in a new server, we've got less posse members now. But it kind of feels like we have, uh, like the gang is condensing itself. Like, toward the events of the end of Red Dead, you know? It's like that. It's like a story. I gotta say, that is a cool look. Good outfit. Damn good. A little fancy. Making me feel a little inadequate. I don't like that, but, you know, aside from that, it's a damn good outfit. All right, so go back here and check this. There's some Capitale back here. You gotta find Capitale. It is not presented to you. What the fuck? Okay, I was gonna say if that was empty. Hey, one of you get back here, see if you can get some Capitale from this box. I'm pretty sure it's a one use, but just in case. I guess that answers that. Let's just close the box. Yeah, all right. That's that's so stingy. Can't believe that. This is a damn good horse. Once I reach level 40, I'm gonna buy a white horse to match up with Dutch. But uh, you also get a, like a, like a coupon, it's weird. At certain levels, Rockstar 
graciously bestows you with a coupon. And at level 40, I get a 40% off coupon for a horse. Actually, I gotta wait until level 66. Level 66, you can get a white Arabian. It's gorgeous. It kind of looks like the Count. What breed is the Count again? I don't know if they have the breed in white in online. I don't know. I think I looked into that at some point. But it was probably back at launch. Capitale! Hello? Tommy? You there? Poor bastard. Like fish in a barrel. Wait, where's the wagon? Where's the wagon? Oh God! Wait! Stop the wagon! Wait! You stop that wagon if you want to stay in this gang. Who's driving that wagon? Look, last time, wagon crashed. Look, Mr. X, it's not that I don't trust you, but step aside. Dutch is taking over. I know that's very ironic, considering I usually crash the damn thing, but that's the way it is. All right. <laughs> you want something done right, you do it yourself. Last time this thing was crashed. If we, if, if you crash, well, if you back out and go back in, it's different. But there's a cooldown, a 30 minute cooldown if you fail one of these missions. And uh, it's easier if you're playing alone to just back out and go back in. But with a posse, it's a little trickier because everybody has to do it. And I feel bad. If everyone has to do that. Oh, that's so slick. Is that a new feature, being able to swap reins? It might be, because you can buy your own vehicles now. Would one of you please bestow us with the kindness of lantern light? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Well, this is ironic. <laughs> We're good. We're fine. You're all right, boy. Here he is. Come on. Can't see. I can't see shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Well, we're there. Barely. Actually, Marissa, I've uh, been talking to Sounds Like Pizza, and we're going to be playing together before too long. Arthur and Dutch, right again. That's right. All right, so uh, train mission two, here we go. We're almost to number three. I'm curious to see how much this is gonna give up. Beautiful. You done good. Held a mirror up to the Central Union. Showed them the killers they are. They know you're working for the Italian. Things gonna get ugly now. So there's only one thing to do. Make them ugly first. Burn them, pillage them, ruin them. Convoys, supply trains, workers. This parasite's full of people's innocent blood. And your precious capitale, for that matter. We just need to squeeze it till it pops. Your conscience is clear. Go. This is a fun one. I'm sure there's a lot of capitale involved, too. All right. We're on a run, gun, and smoke a mission. We're gonna be destroying a shit ton of shit. However, 
If you see any lockboxes or anything, let Dutch handle it. These guys are just slave labor. So Capitale can only be taken by one. It's not shared. It's not duplicated. Only one person can take it. Classic rock star. And classic Dutch. <laughs> you know, the Dutch impression, it just gives me free reign to be an asshole. I'm taking the Capitale and these guys can't do a damn thing about it. This is a fun mission, though. You know, it's not just about killing. It's about destroying, pillaging. Ra well, not that one. But pillaging, yes! There's a... I gotta say, the material for that gold on those guns is fantastic. I got a... a 22 Lancaster repeater. And the material... It's uncanny that they're using. Let's see if there's any Capitale here. Man, that fire looks great. You know, revenue agents might have Capitale on them. I doubt it. I bet you one of these guys may have Capitale. Probably not. But hey, dynamite's worth it. <laughs> Dutch riding in the bitch seat with Arthur Morgan. It's only a bitch seat when Dutch is riding in it, though. Anybody else? It's, in, it's just the second seat. It's just the second seat. It's Dutch that changes the name. Look at that horse. It's tripping balls. Look at him. Look at him. Feed your horse, Arthur. Good lord, you animal. You animal. I'm thinking about hopping back on Red Dead Redemption 2 to get the new update. The Beast! I recommend it. I like this update, so... <laughs> I've said this a few times, but it bears repeating. Alright, Dutch is Rockstar, and Micah is Take 2. Horrible influence. Take two. Those animals. Anyway, I maintain this is a fantastic update. It's just not the update that the game needed. What the game needed was like heists. And more shit to buy that's worth buying. Instead, we got a very necessary update, but not an update for that we waited seven months for. Not an update that they advertised. They called it DLC for one thing. And for another thing... Shit, where's this train going? I better be quick. That was awesome! Let's use that dynamite. Did you see that? Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh, look at that. Oh my god. Dutch Vanderland, death ragdoll. Fucking priceless. And so ends the story of Dutch. I'm not gonna make it, I'm not gonna make it, I'm not gonna make it. Shit. Fuck! Lost my damn hat. Well, so I have Molotovs, Molotovs, fire bottles, shit. Shotgun. Yes. Please tell me some of you got the Capital. So, uh, we should have just, here's how this should have gone. We should have destroyed that first. Because that's the piece of luggage that can get away. But the rest, we should have left one undestroyed, the stationary ones, so we could check for Capital everywhere. I didn't have the foresight for that, but that's okay because the most Capitale is ahead of us. Mission three. And ironically, we're gonna fuck this up. Because that's how it's gonna give us the most rewards. You don't do it right or you're gonna be punished. Alright, this is how it's done. 
Actually, El Blasto, if you're still here, <laughs> go ahead and give me another rundown. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure what we need to do is we need to, uh, kill the man that we're supposed to capture and then loot his body, and that's it. Where the hell is the most, uh, closest blood money? Mission giver. All the way over here. Shit. <laughs> May as well fast travel in that case. What? It's not Dutch's hat. That's better. God damn, Dutch is the best outfit. Well, I don't know. I'd say Dutch and Arthur are tied. Where the he There's not a fast travel post here. Are you kidding me? Real quick, I'm gonna do some, uh... A zombie update. Man, are you naive, you poor, innocent lad. We're not getting a Red Dead Undead Nightmare 2. I wish. Here's the beautiful thing about Undead Nightmare. It took all the characters, it took the setting, and it flipped it on its head. You know, it's, it's, a, it's the ultimate what if. Imagine that. Imagine what if the story of Red Dead Redemption 2, but... There is a zombie outbreak. Picture that. Picture Arthur never getting TB. Okay. Uh, Micah turning into a zombie right away and never driving a stake in between the gang. Picture this. The gang gets tighter. Their bonds stronger. And it's the gang. Arthur, Grimshaw, Karen, Tilly, Lenny, Charles. Uncle, Bill, Arthur, Dutch, all of them making their way through the map together surviving the zombie outbreak. It's like a road trip campaign, you know? That would be so fucking cool. Oh my god. I would love that. <laughs> yeah, I guess fi uh, feeding my horse is kind of out of character for me. Oh, yes, I would love that. Yeah, so Red Dead 3. I know some people may be against it. I think most people would be with it, but give us a prequel. The birth of the Vanderlyn gang. The meeting of Dutch and Hosea. You know, excuse me, Jesus. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Um, young uh, Arthur, etc. That'd be cool. Have it. Fuck yeah. It, this this shit writes itself. Have the game end in Blackwater. Oh man, that's good. Shit, that's good. Damn, I'm good. All right, guys, let's rock. The name's Nukem. Duke Nukem. My horse has balls of steel. Man, sorry, my Duke isn't too good today. Sorry, my voice is really tired today. Can't do Duke when my voice is tired. Can't do Optimus Prime. Can't do Darth Vader. <laughs> shit, you can't do shit when your voice is tired. I can do... I can do my Dutch 70 to 80% of the way today, but... It's not like it is when it's fresh. Yep, we're wearing Dutch's coat. You get this with the new, uh, Outlaw Pass. It's called the Quick Draw Club. 
They replaced the battle pass with a quick draw club. It's 25 gold bars to enter, but you get all those gold bars back if you complete it. And it doesn't take that long to complete. So I'd say it's worth it. Definitely. Look, if you're even a little curious about getting Dutch's costume, get it now. Because eventually they're going to re-release it for 52 gold bars like they did with Arthur. But right now it's only 25. And it's you got those 25 gold back anyway. It's a good-looking uh, outfit, though. Not bad at all. All right, here we go. Train number three. This is the big one. I will be right back, however. Two seconds. Here, have the cat cam. There you go. Two seconds, guys. I will be right back. I wonder what my mentor would say about all this. Probably something really wise that wasn't much earthly use. The thing with these city types is, never take them too serious, like, and be ready to move if they come looking for you. What's his name again? Martelly, Martello, my belly, ah, who cares? Oh, he's a good boy. He's all right. He's fine. Hey, Eddie, how you doing? There he is. <laughs> Arthur Morgan soundboard. You're a good kitty. He's, he's been sleeping there. He's literally three feet away from me. He's been sleeping there. Uh, no matter what kind of noise I'm making. Two more seconds. I'll be right back. My apologies. Sure, I struggled to hold on to a dollar, let alone bloody Capitale. Watch where you're aiming the gun. Enough, you fool. The thing with these city types is, never take them too serious, like, and be ready to move if they come looking for you. Are you joking? What's his name again? Martelly, Martello, my belly, ah, who cares? Sorry about that. I noticed the neighbor's dog was outside and he's a good boy. So whenever he uh, wants in, I let him uh, sleep in the laundry room where it's cool. Give him some food. Okay, 
Here we go. Railroad Contract Part 3 of 3. Now remember, those of you in the posse, leave the director to me. I'm gonna make us some money. Now, it ain't often I sit before you as excited as I am. Truthfully, I'm a little giddy, <laughs> and I'll tell you why. This Central Union fat cat bastard has dipped his balls in the cream for the last time. That's right. Word came down the line from Martelli himself. He wants this robber baron brought to him alive. Naturally, I gave him your word it was as good as done. That's the what. Now for the hell. There's a railroad bridge under construction down near McFarland's ranch. Find the foreman there. Pop his lad under the hammer until he tells you where his boss is holed up. <laughs> the rest I leave to your natural creativity. And if this bastard don't have a stack of capital in his top pocket, I'll kiss the next Englishman I see. Oh my God, he's such a cute cat. He, he's he, he, the thing is the thing about Eddie is that he's a buddy, he's a pal, he's a friend, he's a puppy, he's a puppy in cat form. He loves hanging out, and he's just ch he's chill, he's chill. I love dogs, love them. However, I have a preference toward. The feline animal, and the reason is, I'm a very relaxed person. I'm a very chill person. I vibe with cats. I straight up vibe with them. You hear me? Vibe with them. God damn, I love Posseum. Thank you. Listen, guys. Chef Boyardee, Axe Lord, Baby Punch. I do not take for granted riding with you people. I do take, I derive pleasure from it. It is fun. Thank you. I don't wanna get all cheesy about it, but thank you. From the bottom of my cold, dead, unfeeling heart. Lure away the guards. Ha! <laughs> Wasted time. Just shoot them. Shoot the bastards. Oh shit, those are good guys. My bad. Was that bad? Should I not have done that? All right, let's loot this son of a bitch. No capital? Are you kidding me? Just give us a little. First one's free. Whatever happened to that? But yeah, anyway, uh, he doesn't bark. I love that. Cats don't bark. It's wonderful. However, I always know if someone's, like, coming, approaching the house, he loves watching windows. So if there- fuck! If there's a car he doesn't recognize, he comes straight to me. He reports to me. But he's quiet. He's stealthy. However, babe, I, you know, They've got demeanors. You can read off what their, uh, you know, their, what their vibe is. You can always tell when he is nervous about a new person nearby. So he works well enough as a guard dog, I suppose. But he's great. He's great, man. Straight killer, too. Loves hunting rats and mice. We live in the country, so whenever we get a mouse or a rat, he gets them. I try to get them first before he does. Like, if I know there's one around, I'll set out a, like, a catch and release trap. I'll catch him and then I'll drive over to a forest and release him there. But occasionally he finds him before I do and, <laughs> well, they get dead. All right. The plan is the same. I board the train and you can go with me. Protect me. But leave the director to Dutch Vanderlyn. I'm gonna have to pick up some speed. We gotta hit 77 miles per hour, Marty. Or whatever Doc says. 
<laughs> Shit. Come on, boy. Come on. Shit. 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 Whoa! What the fuck? This is chaos. This is not made for close quarters combat. Fuck, 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 fuck. Alright, loot, loot, loot. Let's see, let's see. Three Capitale. And that... Oh my god. No! Ah! Hello, Eddie. You guys hear that? Listen close. Alright. Well, I guess he's not gonna- he was- he was about to sneeze. He was going That was adorable. Apparently there's some sort of a parasite you can get, and, and, uh, it's harmless, but it'll make you really appreciate your cat. I think I got that parasite. I appreciate him. He's a good boy! How do you feel about the new update? Uh, <laughs> I've said it once, and I'll say it again. I like it a lot, but it's not what people wanted, and you know what? I get it it's not what the game needed they they also advertised it uh it's kind of disingenuous really they advertised it like this was uh and they called it a dlc but it's a jesus good god almighty it looks like a <laughs> it looks like a klingon machete that's fucking awesome i just noticed the skull that is really cool. Also, cool wrap on your gun. Cool hat. Jesus. Was there, is there dynamite there or not? I can't even see it. Ah! Good lord. Stealthy dynamite. Now I've seen everything. But yeah, back to what I was saying. Um, <laughs> this is not Red Dead Online heists. And man, it should have been. Six, seven months, I think they took on this. That's too long for just a quality of life update. And the marketing that they did, they it seems like they spent way more money marketing this update than making this update. They didn't really add a whole lot to buy with your money either. So really, they overhauled Stranger Missions. And they improved them quite a bit. But that's what this is when you get down to it. Personally, I'm really enjoying it. But my expectations were really low. I was anticipating that this was just going to be more Stranger Missions. So when I found out that they actually overhauled and improved Stranger Missions, I was delighted. That being said, it's a good update. Even if we, let's say uh, a couple months ago we got Red Dead Online heists, I would still want this update. This is a necessary thing. It's a great quality of life improvement. That's my thoughts on it. Is this the saloon? Oh, hell yeah. You know what? I'm gonna do this right. Here we go. Come on, boy. I'm hitching my horse. I've made a pact with my horse that I'm gonna start taking care of it. I've been riding this thing like hell. Wait, shit. I barely feed him. I don't have insurance for him. I don't take care- Ah, oh, fuck it. Close enough. <laughs> I'm gonna start taking care of him. I don't deserve a horse like that. Full transparency. What the hell? I thought this was a saloon. Oh, it's McFarland's Am I drunk? My bad. Sorry, boys. Shit. I 
I'm loving the new update so far. Good. Very good. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Nevertheless, Rockstar definitely treats this game like the redheaded stepchild. Oh my god, look, look, he's back. My son, my boy, he is a good cat. Who's my little kitty witty? Little kitty cat. Oh. I love him. I do. I actually do. Best cat I've ever had. Right here. Eddie. Oh. You, you guys don't understand. You know? He's my standard issue. He loves nothing more than sitting on my lap. If I sit down, he will actually start running and meowing to uh, come onto my lap. And if he has the choice of being in a room with people, he's going to be in a room with people. He's very social. He loves it. And I love him. Good cat. All right. Most of that was loading screen, so he didn't miss anything. We're going to the bar. Dutch is buying. Drinks on Dutch. Damn, I love this place. You know, roads, it's a bit old fashioned. You don't come to Rhodes for civilization. You come to Rhodes for hospitality. Zero. Wait, what the hell? Now, what exactly did I do for this town? That they're giving me drinks on the house. Shit. I'm just a little drunk, sir. Nothing personal. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Still on the house. Wow. <laughs> I like how that when you order a whiskey, they don't give it to you as a shot. <laughs> they give you a whole bottle. Yeah. Hey, look, it's Dutch's rings. Oh, fuck yeah, almonds. I hope I grab it with my ring hand so you guys can check it out. It is pretty cool. Damn it. Damn fine bar. Arthur, my son, how are you? How's a little bloodshot I see? Good God. All right, let's get one more. Listen, guys, I appreciate you joining me for this stream. I'm probably gonna be streaming tomorrow. Shit. I'm probably gonna be streaming tomorrow. I stream a couple times a week. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, pull your weight. Leave a like or something in the donation box in camp. Crow feather, fingernail, whatever. Something. Arthur's been doing everything. <laughs> Poor bastard. Look, he's. Jesus. He's all cut up. Oh my god. You know the T-1000? Where's my binoculars? Anyway, this <laughs> this man, he shot up like the T-1000. Look at that. Look at the gore. Who's that back there? Who's that? Anyway, uh, I stream a couple times a week. So I hope you guys join our fam. Join our gang and subscribe. But until next time, it has been a pleasure. And it is a new day. The world's changing. It's time we change, too. And I want to give a special thanks to Baby Punch, Axe Lord, and Mr. Scary Looking. Uh, Scary Looking Axe Lord has been with us for a couple streams. Baby Punch is a veteran. Been with us since the start. Oh, good Lord. Please. No fire. Arthur, get us out of here. And thank you to Chef Boy RD. The fifth.
Dressed like a total dick, though. Who's he dressed as, anyway? Man, he looks like an asshole. I, however, am dressed as a man you can trust. Anyway, I appreciate you guys at a blast. We stream Red Dead Online. We're gonna start streaming this game on the regular. I love this game. It's a labor of love. That's what this game is. Uh, I appreciate this game. I love- I make love to this game. Uh, I married this game. <laughs> It is a masterpiece, and you can't drive for shit, son. No offense. Anyway, uh, yeah, feel free to posse up with us. We play on PlayStation 4. It would be my honor to ride with you. But until next time, game massively. Stay frosty. Stay with me. Have faith. And outlaws for life. Take care, guys. I'll see you soon.